Hello, this is Jasuno Krahur here to talk about Brexit escape room workshops to help small and medium companies and maybe some bigger ones as well to plan for Brexit. Um, at the time of recording, it's about a month before the Brexit date, uh, and nobody seems to know whether or not it will actually happen on the planned date or be slipped by a little or a lot or whatever. And even if it does take place, what needs to happen is very unclear. In any project, if we have enough time and money and people to do the work, it's easy enough. But in particular, we need to know what it is needs to be done um, and what the limitations are and so on. And in this case, uh, it seems that what needs to be done is very, very unclear as I make this recording. Now, I'm actually on a border between Germany, where the grass is, and Switzerland, uh, where the buildings and footpath are. And the rules are the same on both sides, so it's easy. There's no border. But if, for example, you uh, divide, as Brexit does, into two zones, uh, then obviously all sorts of um, new regulations uh, come into force and they have to be uh, put in place in companies. Now a lot of companies would say, well I don't know where to start, um, I don't have enough time um, and anyway I don't know what I need to do and although there is plenty of advice about things that you could look at, the priorities are not clear. In these workshops what we do is we we say let's start now putting together a plan so that we know as far as possible what are our objectives, what are our limitations, who's going to make the decisions, is it going to be done by somebody internal or external and so on. And a lot of that preliminary work can take place before the actual objectives have, have stabilised. So by doing these workshops you give yourself a bit of extra lead time and lower the pressure and improve the chances of um, su surviving the turbulence with maybe a little bit less pressure than you might otherwise. So there you have it, these workshops, they're two day workshops to do the planning for uh, implementing for business uh, in the context of Brexit. They are not workshops to tell you what to do for Brexit plenty of advice for that from government chambers of commerce and so on, trade associations and so on. Um, but what they do, we, we actually come out of those events with a plan. If we're lucky, we'll be ahead of the wave and uh, we can wait until the information comes. But it's more likely that you'll be glad that you started early. I look forward to meeting you there.